Hello pandas and other scrap enthusiasts. Today we are trying a challenge, something we've never done before on the channel. 100 dumpsters, 100 garbage bins. Yes, I had a few different ideas on how to celebrate hitting 100,000 subscribers, and the one that stood out to me the most was a celebration of where we started all the way to where we are now. We've come a long way, but never too far from the magic and mystery of the, all of the cool things that you can find in the bins. So that is what I want to do today, and I want you to come with me, and I want you to keep an eye out because there may be some hidden Easter egg somewhere along the way. That's your only hint, but those are the vibes, and that is the challenge. How much can we find in a hundred bins and a hundred dumpsters? How much can we make? I don't know. Hopefully a lot. This is a big number, but we'll see how it goes. Come on. One. Two, three, four, five, leatherette jacket, all worn out though. Heater slash massage. Seat and a hat. Hey, it's not much, but it's a little bit of wire. Is that four or five? <laughs> I think remembering is going to be the hardest part. Six. Well, just to be sure. Six. Huh. Seven. Eight. Oh. Nine. Are we doing this? Are we doing this part? Yeah, this time we'll take blue cans. Hey. <laughs> Memories. Oh, they were growing some peppers. Nine, ten, eleven, and eh, private property. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Huh, don't put it in. I won't. I don't see your camera though. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Are these? That's definitely plastic, isn't it? It's gonna be mostly plastic. Grab that one though. Twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. <laughs> hey, I recognize that truck. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Thirty-one. What's that? Come back for that one. Not much of a lane down that way. 31. Because we're right here. Thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, 
42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. Half of these are empty. 52, 53. But I know they haven't come through. 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. Ooh, that smell. Can't you smell that smell? Sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, gross, sixty-five. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna take a boo down there. Don't worry about the blue bin thing. It's not really weighing on my conscience. It's been years since we... 67. Actually pulled anything out of blue bin, so I don't think we are... <laughs> I'm unbothered. 67. 68. 69. Nice. Hello, kitty cat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 71. 72. Oh, come on now. How about that? Oof. Hot beer. 73, 74. 75. 76. Wow, we're getting there pretty quick, actually. 77, 78, are those? Nah, they're crappy press board. 78, 79, 80. Geez, we're gonna finish 100 before we even get back to the truck. 81, 82, 83. 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, that's a new one, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93 flies in that bin. We could go that way, but I sort of planned a bit of a circle. 94. No brass. Unfortunate. I've already had 94. Oh, there's our friend. 95, 96, 97. 98, 99, 100. Whew, that one smells real bad. All right, interesting. I guess we'll just count up all the way back to the truck because I sort of have a whole route plotted out here. In hindsight, I maybe should have gone for just 100 black bins. One, sweet. Was that number two? Three, four. Counting's not really my strong suit. Five, six. What the Nelly is that? Cool. It's like a little at home hydraulic crane game. 
Plastic. That's plastic. Ooh. Nice piece of aluminum, though. Any more? A couple little ones. Cool. I lost count again. What was that? 12? 14? 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, warm today, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, a range hood. I can grab that for steel on the way back. 31, nothing valuable. 32, 85, oh. 85, found the kitchen sink. Definitely come back around for that. Don't let me forget. 201. Okay, so I think having broken 200, that means we definitely checked 100 black bins. So anyway, slice it. We nailed it. 202. Ooh. What have we here? Laptop bag. Okay. Okay. Those are keepers. A lot of gloves thrown out. A whole lot of gloves. Connelline Crush. Faith No More. Okay, wow. Um, Sepultura. Another Sepultura. Okay, I think... I think this is one of those situations where we just grab all of them. Alice in Chains. Wankmar. Wake up and smell the carcass. All right. Identified. That's a pretty crazy find, and uh, we are grabbing all of those. Autumn. What an absolutely perfect season. I'm actually getting really sweaty. I shouldn't have worn pants and a shirt under my uh, coveralls here. <laughs> but this has been a delightful reminder of the stuff that we used to find back when uh, residential bins were the, the focus. It's slow going, right? Um, this hasn't actually taken that long. We've been out maybe an hour, something like that. Peaked in 210 bins, and we found, you know, that many bottles, a bunch of extruded aluminum, a uh, stainless steel sink, and a bin absolutely packed full of uh, CDs, which look like pretty good ones. They might as well have a peek, right? Nothing really. Also nothing. Two. What is that? A ninja. Huh. 
It don't matter me none. Although I guess there's a motor, huh? Nice. Oh, and there's the truck. 70. All right. 270 bins. Now let's go pick up our stash of treasures. I want these like you wouldn't believe. We'll go over those later. Whoa. Ooh, A7X. Ooh, anemia. <laughs> Burzum. <sighs> Radiohead. Nirvana. <sighs> We're going to take that too. And that one. Absolutely insane. How else do you describe that? What's that? Wall? Oh, trimmer. Better than... We found it. Yeah. Holy cow. Blessings. Ah. Ah. Let's go. Already, I am calling that a win. I almost forgot how much fun it was to go through those kinds of dumpsters. Because you find treasures that you wouldn't... Well, they're not dumpsters. You find treasures that you wouldn't find in regular dumpsters. But that was the easy part. Now, we got to do 100 dumpsters. This is going to take a little bit, so uh, we better just get started. I don't even know where I'm going to find that many. Um, I'm going to start with some... I have a few ideas. Let's get going. Now, I really don't want to lose count of these ones. One... Uh, nah. Two. That makes sense. Hmm. Three. What is that? What is all that? That's recycling. It's a battery powered weed whacker. That's a kind of gross rug. Medical stuff. Huh. Fake fig tree. Those actually sell all right. Mm, I don't want that right now. That's three. Four. Ooh. Five. Okay, these are... Is that rice or mango? Yeah, I don't want to know. Yeah, we're gonna have to go to a different area, I think. These have been emptied. Hey, hey, hey. This is an absolute score. 
It's got the rocks. Needs a needs a handle, but he's like a hundred bucks. Oh, and it's got the, the folding legs. Yeah, I already bought one of these. They're like a hundred dollars, so. <sighs> Especially with all the fires lately, those are the only kind you're allowed to have while camping, so that will sell. Quick handle, easy 50. Okay, we're back at the house. Uh, <laughs> she started making a funny sound, and I think I figured out what happened. It's, uh, it's, it's down here. It's my drive shaft U joint that went. Um, that's actually not so bad, uh, but it is annoying and it's gonna make it difficult to go dumpster diving. Um, so I guess I could just disconnect the drive shaft and uh, carry on as normal until I get the time to do that. Um. All right, out about grabbing parts and uh, one, two, that counts, right? Does that make it seven? Yeah, oh, my fingies. Oh, that actually looks pretty good. I'm not sure how to get into that. That also looks pretty good. Um, well, it's mostly wood. And uh, we're driving the car right now, obviously, so we're not, uh, whew. And that is all. Uh, we're not grabbing any of that right now. Looks pretty good, though. I wonder if I could sell that. It's like the Starbucks display thing. I mean, maybe I could sell it, but I don't think I can just grab it. I'm calling this one eight. That'll do. Ooh, there's a bit of copper in that one. Mm. I got that. Sweet. And that is the only piece I see. Got the U-joint. Alrighty, U-joint is in and seems fine. Now let's give her a quick test, see how she sounds. Well, I think that's done it. Lots of opportunities to learn stuff this year, huh? Eh, I wasn't doing anything. All right, welcome back. Um, the, uh, the, the rapid unplanned self-disassembly of my U-joint definitely affected how I had planned on this video going, so I'm gonna have to focus on places where I think there's gonna be a lot of dumpsters rather than uh, having quite the same amount of fun looking in a whole bunch of different ones that I haven't tried before. I was hoping to, to get away with doing that, but it's okay. We're still aiming for the 100 dumpster target, and we've got 
eight in the bag already. So uh, yeah, I found a spot where uh, you might recognize these dumpsters. We're, we're gonna see if there's anything better in them this time. Let's go have a look. Nine. Nothing there. Ten. Oh. Wasn't expecting that. What a decent little bit of prepared. Gonna have to chop that down when we get the chance. Not mad about that. Cool. Ten. Not an aluminum rim. Whoa. <laughs> Drop something in. Uh, no, I'm looking for treasure. Thank you. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <gasps> that could have been bad. Okay. Let's try to be a little more careful with wheels. Oh, ah. Drove over a peanut butter cup. Now, if only I knew where to find a garbage to throw that napkin out. <sighs> Twelve. Eh, not much. I see that though. Thirteen. Uh, one's all carpet. Aha. Kind of ridiculous. I keep finding aluminum rims here. Uh, some of you may remember where we are now. Fourteen. I think that's steel. Oh. That is... All aluminum. All right. Is that 16 or is this 16? Call this 16. 17. Nothing. 
18. 18. That was a bit of wire. Is that thing metal? It sure is. Eighteen. Nineteen. Alright. That's kind of cool, actually. Twenty. One. Yeah, it's a pee bottle. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Just tires for days out here, man. What's the story there? Twenty four. Twenty five. Twenty six. Hmm. Potential brass. Unfortunately, not brass. That's all right. I suppose it can go in as steel. There's somebody in that one. 28. Twenty-nine. Yeah, that'll do. Thirty. How does that even count? Thirty-one. Meh. Thirty-two. That's a lot of avocado. And a lot of bird poop. Just food stuff. 33. Ooh, pretty. 34. Well, I wanted to check that one, but it looks like I missed my chance. All right, I kind of lost track, but I think this is 32. That's a big nope. 33. We're a third of the way, and this makes 34. That's all plastic. That sounds like metal. Thirty-five. There we go. That works better. Thirty-six. Mm, cardboard. Thirty-seven. Mm, couple cans. Rockstar. 
and lime. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. And 50 50. That works. Thirty. Oh. Forty. Oh. This one's pretty serious. That does not look like something that would be very, very difficult to to remove. I think we're gonna pass on this one. Ooh. Those look really good. I would love to inherit those. 41. Oh, wow. I kind of want to ask, but I definitely want those. 42. Ooh. Yes. want. Okay, I gotta get in there and ask about these. Because I want those real bad. Oh! Plastic. And a starter. These are quite heavy. How do we get them in? Oh, sweet. It's already released one. Because I don't want that. I'd love to be able to remove those, but those are going to be... I don't think I have the tools with me to do that. Oh, I might have the right size. Oh, well, maybe. Quite a few of those, actually. All right, give me a sec on these. Nice pieces of extrusion. All right, that's 42. I'm gonna ask about the, uh, about those and those. That's a lot of weight. So, I'll get back to you. Because we certainly, that's like a full load. We can't fit, really, we can fit like six of those. 43. Hmm. Basically nothing. 44. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, that's a no, 4010, or some places like to call it, 50, no, 51, 52. There's no metal there. 53. No. 54. Uh. Well, this was unexpected. There used to be a couple bins here that was pretty, pretty good, but uh, they're not here anymore. Instead, Somebody did a bit of a cleanup and uh, left some goodies behind.
far as I can tell. They left these here for me. Looks good to me, brother. Thank you very much. 56. Mm, nothing. 57. Oh, these are kind of nice, actually. Some nice strips of what looks like hardwood. 58. Okay. Okay. Is that empty or full? Oh my god. Big yes, please on the underground copper line. What did I say? 58? Hmm. Is that one busted or is it okay? I mean, yeah. I want that. Stainless. Copper or plastic, sorry. I want that. Definitely want that. And Stainless. Let's see if we can get the glass out of these. You know, it's funny, I was committed to grabbing all of the, uh, the ferris that I found as well, and yet we're having a really good day for non-ferris. Good enough. We can always reorganize later if we want to. But for now, that looks pretty good. What was that? 58? So, 59. Eh. 60. Hmm. Uh, there's actually a whole bunch of bottles in here. Start motor. Second bag of bottles. <laughs> Blessings. 61, 62, no, 63. Mm. 64, oh, it's cardboard. 
65. I don't like using those. 66 has no metal. 66. Oop. All right. 67. 68. No. 69. Nice. Is that welding wire? Or just straight up copper? Yeah, no. Not copper. But it's metal. 70. What an enormous piece of acrylic. Oh, it's from a winner's sign. That's cool. I don't really see anything else in there. Unless we want giant pieces of acrylic, which. I don't. 71. Yeah. Uh, 71. That's a no. 72. Also a new. It's a lot of steel. A lot of rims. Wow. wonder if that's the scrap bin. Ah, uh, it's barbed wire. 72? No. 73. Uh, Hmm. Nothing to get excited about. 74. 70. 5. And that marks the three quarter point. We're nearly there. over, I think. That's just plastic. What about that one? Also plastic. Uh, aluminum lined, but... Not very exciting pieces, but actually got some decent weight to them. Oh. A little piece of copper, a little piece of brass. Okay. Let's get that out of our way for now. Hmm. Oh, this just got interesting. It could just be the tiny piece of copper tube, but I kind of I kind of like number seventy-five. Oh, there we go. Five more to go. Twenty six. I mean, seventy six. Seventy seven. No. Seventy eight. Seventy nine. Oh, that's a hard no. Mm. 
still counting it. 83. 84. 85. Gloves. 86. Cardboard. 87. Ugh. Ew, that's full of something. Eighty-eight. Whew, look at the size of that. Eighty-nine. What's that then? Hmm, well, we got a power cord. Ah, eh, sorta. We got a cord. Piece of steel. Another piece of steel. This is a nice big one, but I'm not really seeing any metals. Hmm. What is that? Superior switchboard devices. Huh. Are those copper or aluminum? That's the question. They are copper. All right, well, let's take this the way it is. Clean it up later. I don't really mind. Maybe I do see something. Uh, no, that's a foosball table. It's gonna be really hard to get the metal bits off. Oh, that's heavy. All right. Uh, half a signboard. It's 90, we're almost done. We're almost there. See if we can make this a good one. Uh, 91 now. Who am I kidding? It's already a good one. It's always a good one. With you guys around. 91. 92, oh, that doesn't count for anything. 93. 92. Oh, we got keyboards. And, uh, so what is that? It's some sort of a, is that just like super thick welding rod? I'm not familiar with these things. One of you must know what that is. It's obviously copper on the outside, or at least copper plated, but the core. What is it? Shoot, what are we at? 91. Is that 92? 92. Jeez, look at all these motors. Forklift repair, huh? Ninety-three. Dodge Ram seats in amazing condition. Well, in good condition. 94. Wow. <laughs> this one's real smelly. That is the dirtiest couch I've seen maybe ever. <clears throat> 95. Six. Whoo, 97. Boring. 98. Those are not recycling. I mean, I suppose it technically is recycling. Ah. 
because that is exactly what we are going to do with them. Uh -huh. I think that was actually 97, 98. So that would make this 99. Uh, I don't see nothing. And a bird's wing <laughs> on 100. Well, that's a little weird. I'm gonna say that's a good omen. And uh, just to be sure, 100. 100. 100. Yeah, this one very clearly says Blackfoot Metals on the side. We're not taking anything out of this. But that sure would be nice. That's a decent pile of stuff. Those are probably close to 10 bucks each. Anyway, I think that concludes our our adventure for this time. So, hey, there's a there's a water heater. What a great time to see if there's actually anything in it. There's not. Now, time to head home and see just how bad my keeping track really was. Well, I think that'll do it. Wow, that was actually a long journey. But we got there, and boy did we get there. This is an amazing haul. We got a bunch of steel, and some, uh, some prepared steel, that's the good stuff, but also a fair amount of copper, quite a bit of aluminum, and uh, a big old bag of bottles, as well as some treasures on top. I would call this a massive success. But besides the scrap metal, two things stand out as some particular treasures that I'm pretty happy we found. One is this propane fire pit, which I need to test, but honestly, they're not that complicated. I imagine it probably works just fine. Just needs a handle. And then, this here massive collection of CDs. I mean, okay, it's not as massive as the DVD collection, but these are all in pristine condition, and the couple that have broken cases, there's enough extra cases that I can swap things around and make them all perfect. Now, rather than read out all the names I recognize, I'll try and just show a couple shots that uh, you can pause or slow it down if you're really curious what's in here. But there's definitely a couple uh, that I will be keeping, and it's going to take me a little while to go through all of these and decide which ones I'm not. But uh, the ones that I'm not, what I'm most excited about is that this isn't just the best-selling CDs in history. This is somebody's curated collection of mostly metal. So these will hold some value and they will be a lot easier to sell either privately or to trade in at a record store for for some some vinyl that I want. Yeah, I started picking up a few vinyl here and there. So that is easily the most exciting of this haul, I think. Well, it's the most fun. That and we got those two uh, helmets. Now, one more thing. I'm not a fan of performative charity, but if I didn't show that part, then I'd have people grumping at me for going through the blue bins, you know, for the first time in years. But if anybody does grump at it, not only do they not watch the whole video, but obviously they are less committed to the well-being of those less fortunate and more in posturing through their manufactured outrage. I only hope that the person who does find that also finds the bottle bag super useful and doesn't just throw it out as soon as they yeah, take the bottles out. But that's outside of my control. I am. Oh, speaking of which, um, this weekend will be the last weekend that the bottle bags are available on the merch store. That's thubstore.com. So if you were on the fence, if, you know, well, if you're on the fence, then, like, don't spend your money on, spend your money on something more important to you. But if you knew you wanted them, this is the last weekend to get them. So just a heads up, word to the wise. Now, as far as this huge haul of metal, I was hoping this big 100K subscriber special extravaganza was going to include a roundup, a clear out, and a, a sum total of everything that we found. But unfortunately, this one's already heckin' long. So uh, we're gonna have to do that next week. I was planning on doing a channel update along with this, you know, future plans. And uh, I think I'm just gonna combine those so that'll be next week. And I think it should be a pretty decent haul. So, 
final thoughts, thank you so much for being a part of this and, and helping this channel grow to as much as uh, to the size that it has. And here's to uh, the next 100k. I'm looking forward to it and I've got a few plans. And uh, for those of you who made it all the way to the end here, I wanted to give a little bit of a thank you in some, you know, more tangible form. So basically, if you if you did find the uh, the code hidden in the video, that is basically a free hoodie. Uh, I'm not sure how long uh, I'm gonna stick with this supplier. So uh, in future, these may be the legacy versions of the hoodie. So if you were on the fence about getting that, the first five people to use that code at thubstore.com will get $70 off their purchase of $70 or more. I know it's not exactly a free hoodie. That's a lot more difficult to do with the codes. Basically, you just pay shipping. I think it's a really great design. I really like it. And I updated the design. They seem to wear off a little fast, so I changed it so that it's only available in black and uh, the it's got a black fill rather than just being white outlined. So I think the print should last a lot longer now. I haven't actually tested it. I haven't gotten one of those versions myself, so fingers crossed. Anyway, thanks for watching. That one's for you. Um, hope you enjoy. I certainly enjoy being here. Thanks for coming along on the adventure and I'll see you on the next one. Leave it better than you found it. Keep doing the thing.